Hi there, Chris here. Saturday morning ramble. Okay, what's this ramble about? This ramble is about um, making sure when when you see your loved ones and your friends that you you leave them with you know the thought that hey, you matter. I love you because we don't always know what tomorrow brings. Um, and this has been brought home this week by our losing of Parky, which was not unexpected, but, um, I went, uh, the casting club had, uh, their, their meeting, their August meeting in, um, in the announcements, um, the casting director, a guy named Sam who is much younger than me, had suffered a stroke. And um, unfortunately, he's, he has, fortunately, he has his language, but he has uh, lost some mobility. And uh, I mean, this is out of the blue. He's got to be, I don't know, maybe eight, nine years younger than myself. So you never know. You never know what tomorrow brings. Um, also, there's another instance. Um, someone else I know um, passed away. Actually, in the in the casting club, in the last say three years, a great we've lost a great many members. And uh, people you see one week, the next week they're they're gone. So. Do, do put aside petty grievances and and those things because those things really, you know, in the long run don't count. It's the friendships that you've had for so many years. Um, so there, that's, that's on that. And a lot of this is in my mind because uh, I am going to attend a reunion of my grammar school. In grammar school here then was uh, grades uh, one through six. And I'm 70. So <laughs> this is, it was a, been a very long time since I've been in grammar school. But it will be interesting to see, I, how do you say it, who's left um, and what <laughs> what condition they're in. Uh, I think one of the things, I, I'm going with my oldest friend who I've known for literally 60 plus years. And uh, I've, I've only spoken to him on the phone recently and he seems um, a little, it, like his voice seems a little weaker. Now, he did suffer an injury when he when he crashed his his bike um but just overall he doesn't sound as quick or i don't know it scares me you know it scares me um one of the things i'm really grateful for if yeah be grateful for today and the friends you have and who's who's all here but one of the things i'm grateful for as in a lot of my older friends and friends my my own age and older um i seem a lot quicker um how do i put it i don't know um my mind is still really sharp now i do misspeak but geez i <laughs> misspoke years ago and I think it's because my mind works way faster than my mouth. Um, <laughs> at least I hope. No, I mean, that that people have, have ac actually said, you know, I think that's what your issue is. Your mind is working way faster than your mouth. But uh, one of the things that keeps me sharp is, is doing the lock picking. And, I mean, that physically, that... You know, eye to hand 
coordination, you know, <clears throat> mixed in with, with your brain trying to figure out a puzzle. But also just the interaction. Um, I mean, email or I text uh, half a dozen people every day. So I follow along those threads and many, many emails in a lot of comments on my channel, um, you know, whatever video I posted in others, back and forth, back and forth. So through the course of the day, I probably have 65, 70 interactions, which I'm following the threads, hopefully, and keeping up. So I think that's, I think that's valuable for keeping everything, you know, running. Uh, I physically I have definitely slowed down, uh, but that's to be expected. I do have some health issues, but uh, hey, I'm grateful for all of what I can do and all that. So can we wrap this up? Yes, we're gonna wrap this up. Um, somebody asked on this this little Lockwood euro can i can i pick it with the kw1 and the answer is yes and i have actually uh, i'm not going to be doing any picking on this now but it's probably rambled enough anyway i'm grateful to all you guys and all that we do um very sad losing parky uh my father actually passed away from complications of, of parkinson's disease and uh, it is not, it's not hereditary, but I can tell you firsthand, it, it's, it's a pretty nasty thing. Anyway, come on, let's get on an upbeat here. Um, the upbeat is, is the people that are donating to Parky's um, GoFundMe. That's upbeat. And, and the people that are picking locks for Parky. So the Parky A to Z. Anyway, thanks for watching. That's the ramble. Oh, a big shout out to Dana Reed. Um, I was just on PW Live. <laughs> and I was just about to type in my, hey, Dana Reed. Yeah, I do that whether she's there or not. And she actually was in there. So very cool. Anyway, I'm going to get back to that. Thanks for watching. Hit the like. Do subscribe. Uh, and we'll see you next time.